what is up ladies and gentlemen kings reaper here back with another new game now this game is called creep wars td which stands for tower defense now i've seen only couple of clips couple of pictures of this game and i remember how much i loved playing on the old warcraft 3 those modded maps where you have tower defenses different types of tower defenses so i pretty much decided to give this game a shot let's see what it is all about okay now we're gonna deep go we're just gonna go deep on this game right now tutorial campaign fun maps hmm do we need tutorial no phone please stop reminding me i don't need anything now hush be quiet be quiet okay do we go through the tutorial yeah let's go quickly through it oh hello there i am all-knowing wizard i will help you to defeat all evil forces <laughs> and enemies will attack you in waves you can see the wave counter in the top left corner if you think your defense is strong enough you can start the next wave with the start next wave button Okay, so we are on wave zero. Mm -hmm. To defeat the enemies, you have to summon defense units. These units are bound to stay at the place you summon them. You can select one of the glowing summoning voids by left-clicking them. Okay, the green voids are summoning melee units. The yellow voids are ranged units. Okay. The task panel will pop up and you can summon some units. Now create a defense and withstand the first wave. Hmm, so we have mage, archer. Let's go with mage. And here we can go with footman, mace. Um, let's go with the mace tower. And then another ranged. Let's go with the archer tower. Perfect. Let's start the wave. The enemies arrived. You can select the enemy by left clicking at them. Now you can see some details infor detail information about them. Mm -hmm. Take a look at the armor. Your tower will be more or less effective depending on the armor type of the enemies. Okay, for example, pierce damage is good versus light armor, but weak against heavy armor. Perfect. Oh, you can actually lift up the camera with the scroll wheel. Perfect. Uh, yeah, that didn't tell me shit. Why? Uh oh, there we go. The archer. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Good, 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 good. Light infantry. Free unit. 12 health. Um, am I gonna leak on the first wave? Are you kidding me? Oh, that's probably the infinite wave. I'm gonna guess. Fast, high health, light armor. He hits for six. Is that his damage? So I guess this determines the range. This determines how fast they hit. This is the value of the tower and this is probably the damage. Okay. Yes. Show the range of the tower. Sell this tower. Hmm. Okay, let's get back to it. Great, you've survived the first wave of enemies. Now you got some gold as bounty for killing the enemies. Perfect. With this gold, you can upgrade your unit. Select the unit with a left click and upgrade it. Yes. Yes. Uh, how? What? Is sell? Oh, I guess I can... Oh, yeah, now I can upgrade him. Perfect. So it takes a while. Or... Oh, yeah, yeah, now, now he's upgraded. Perfect. Oh, we are defeated. Perfect. But at least we get the point of the game. Okay. Okay. Now we know what we're supposed to do, how we do it, and everything else. Let's go through campaign human campaign one hmm sir orcish ships arrived at the shore of velforda there are only a few soldiers protecting the lighthouse we must form a defense line and stop them yeah perfect so i guess we are gonna start off with 
Close range deals pierce damage, blunt splash damage. Oh, he deals, he deals splash. Uh, let's go with this. Um. Okay, I guess we'll take that as well, maybe full melee for the start, yeah, let's go like that and see how this flies, because I think these range towers are going to be quite out of the range, so yes. I can see the range here, okay, perfect, first wave done. Let's just start it. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. How much do these cost? Ten. So they do pierce damage, effective against light. These are effective against medium armor. But I wonder what's the range. So I can see the range on this tower. And on this one. Oh, so... Yeah, I think they should put it to be toggle. So that all the towers range is shown immediately. Maybe with different colors, you know, you just... Huh? Okay, never mind. Let's try building a medium armor, light armor, and these guys are medium armor. Let's put a mage tower. I really wonder what's his range. Yes. Oh yeah, he does have quite a lot of range actually. Okay, he's gonna be obviously very important because he can still shoot them all the way around. Uh, that's gonna be actually quite good. Yeah, let's start the next wave. Yes. You see, instead of selecting the tower and deactivating the range circle, that should be automatically voided or there should be a button button to, to like toggle it on and off. I would really much like that. What? Ooh! What the hell was this? Ghosts? Okay. Uh, let's get a ranger as well here. The archer tower. So these guys are heavy armor. And you, hello. Yes. Pierce damage. Uh, blunt splash, uh, right. I can't buy anything right now. Ooh, these guys have a lot of health. Okay. Deal the damage. Deal the damage. Where's the mace, mace tower? Yeah, there we go. Okay. These guys are gonna kill him. That's good. That's good. Perfect. Yeah, let's just start the next wave. So, how much what is the want? upgrade? So, it's 20 gold first level. Light armor. Good. So, these guys should be effective against them. What? Right? Pierce damage and pierce damage is effective against light armor. Yeah. So, the splash actually spreads on two targets, I guess. Which is kind of okay. That's nice. But I think I'll be upgrading first yes. these towers. Yeah. Let's upgrade that. Let's start the next wave. It's going to get upgraded soon. Perfect. Mm. The next upgrade is 100 gold. Okay. Now, I've noticed that only he is capable of shooting ghosts somehow. So I'm worried if the ghosts come again and stuff that actually he's gonna be my only defense. Kill him! Nice. Yes. Ooh, we actually have two paths. So effective against heavy armor, effective against light armor. Um Let's see what comes next. This is medium armor, so he should be actually quite good against them. Um, yes. Yeah, let's build a catapult. That sounds fun. Ooh, what's his range? Oh my god. Is that, like, his range is... 
Oh, his range is over the whole map. <laughs> Perfect. Hide the range. Show the range. Yeah. And here, show the range. Hide the range. Okay. 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 Fine. We cannot withstand their overwhelming forces for much longer. We have to retreat and leave the lighthouse at their hands. Just hold the defense for one more wave to secure the withdrawal of the troops. Okay, I guess... What's this? This is... Heavy armor. When are you gonna start shooting at him? Come on. Shoot! Oh, there we go. Ooh, he does nice damage. This does some insane damage, actually. Okay, so now we know that actually the catapult or whatever it's called. Oh, yeah, catapult tower level one. They have unlimited range. Ooh, victory. Main menu. Perfect. Let's get to level two. Hmm, we made it to the hedge... Hedge mill? Okay, so we made it to the hedge mill tavern. Here we can recruit other well fordon soldiers. Unfortunately, the orcs followed us through the wild woods of Maycam, the barbaric, barbaric maybe. I guess they meant barbaric. The barbaric orcish forces have cut the ancient trees of the forest to set up a camp. We have to stop them before they taste the great hedge mill beer. Hmm, okay, so I need to have a taste of my own beer, so can I zoom in? Oh, that's it, I can zoom, okay, so this is gonna be crucial point, and this here is gonna be crucial point as well, so no, actually, let's put a mage over here. Is there a point here? No. So I'm kind of going to focus on this area to hold them here. So... Hmm. Let's put another ranger tower and I'm going to upgrade them to... Catapults yes. as soon as possible. So what's his range? Not bad. That's actually yes. half decent. I don't know if there is an option to toggle it through through keyboard, maybe? Like a shortcut? I don't know. Anyway, let's let's leave the range towers do their job. So that's the spawn point. This is also good for catapult, I guess. Maybe if I put a catapult up here, that should be good. I won't use any of um, melee towers for now. I mean, so far it's going fine. Three towers, they can clear the first wave easy. And as soon as it's cleared, I think I'll be able to upgrade one of these guys. What Should have enough, right? Oh yeah, let's upgrade him to catapult right away. And start the next wave. Now, when do you start shooting? God, it seems like he can't shoot because of the ridge. Is that it? Oh yeah. Oh yeah, that's it. He can't shoot because of the ridge. Oh my god, and he's so slow. Oh yeah, he yeah, I should have definitely built this tower somewhere else. This is not gonna work. I didn't know it's not gonna shoot over the ridge. But yeah, it's obviously you need to put it here, because then it can shoot down the line, not miss, and shoot here. Yeah, this is gonna suck. All 
Are you gonna shoot him? No? Wow! Wow! Well, you tried. You tried. So build this one again here, and I need to sell this one, because... Like... This is not gonna work. For how much can I... Oh my god. 50% refund. And I get 5 gold. How is that 50%? So let's see. Sell it. <laughs> right. <laughs> That's 50%. Okay. Don't question me. That's 50%. <laughs> so you paid... 10 gold initially to build it, and then 20 golds to upgrade it, and you get 5 gold back. So that's like 50% from initial price, not from the total price. Uh, right, now this is gonna end pretty much miserably. Let's just restart the level immediately. Yeah, 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 we went through all of that. Thank you, bye. So we need Ranger here. We're gonna have wizard right here. And then we're gonna have here um, another wizard, yeah. Let's start the wave. Perfect. Ah, the beer. <laughs> Yeah, I think these are the optimal positions. Now I need to see when I upgrade him to catapult now. Is he actually going to shoot down this line and here or no? Okay, so this is the furthest way I can get the camera. nice like the first wave is it's fine it's not that hard you can get it pretty much easily and when we kill all of them i should be able to upgrade that tower immediately i mean this uh, the game doesn't look that bad um but it does have quite a lot of room to grow yeah what do you want I want money that's what I want money yes. I want you to kill those creeps those orcs yeah okay let's see what are we going to get with this upgrade is it going to shoot immediately to here it should right Right? Are you kidding me? Are you actually kidding me right now? Why can't it shoot? What? This must be some kind of a joke. That's ridiculous. It should be firing from here through like here. Why is it not? firing i don't get it um right this strat is obviously not going to work oh well the gg gg boys gg yes gg uh right so we can actually put another archer yeah let's put another archer here so what if i click start next wave nothing and this catapult is useless right now in that position where it's sitting right now, it's useless. And 
these guys have quite a lot of health. Oh, it does splash damage? Well, that's good to know. Blunt splash damage. Hmm. Okay. That's perfect. So when you have, like, slower moving targets, this is actually whatsoever efficient. Yeah, seems like it. Okay. Um... Do I build another tower? Yeah, well, I won't do it for now. Let's save up the money and then we can upgrade at least yes. one of these guys. So, from far range with pierce damage, light armor. So, yes. if I upgrade him... Mm -hmm. They do magic damage, which means the armor should not be affecting them in any possible way it's a good thing that these guys are also slow so yeah the catapult is gonna do the work now although on the second wave it's not that effective um so what's your range now this is your range now let's upgrade and see if the range maybe increases oops no it's still the same Effective against light armor. So we have something to destroy light armor. We have something yes. to destroy heavy armor. Yes. Oh, these guys. I need to upgrade him. Come on. Kill them. There's the ghost. There's the ghost. Oh, the ghosts are so fast, man. But I think we'll survive this wave. We should survive it, right? Yeah, he's about to die. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Good. Start the next wave. This isn't going that bad. I mean, the second wave kind of banged me over. Because it was... Those guys were fast. But I think we'll be fine. Are they spaced enough? Or no? Hmm. Not sure. Do I need another tower? Are they gonna make it? Hold on, let's build another uh, 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 mage. Let's go with mage tower, come on. Come on guys, come on. You can do this. You can do this. Kill them. Don't let them pass. Hodor. Hodor! Hodor! Ooh. Made it! Yes. Um, do we upgrade him? Let's see what's the next wave. Oh. Medium health, medium armor, medium speed. Um. Hmm. Yeah, I'm actually gonna upgrade him, the mage tower as well. What? Yeah, let's see how this goes. I mean, it's kind of pointless if you ask me to put a melee unit down here, because he can only hit here, while the range towers can actually hit while the units are passing in one side of the can ch channel, the channel, channel, channel. And the other side of the channel as well. Which... It, it helps a lot, to be honest. It helps a lot. So I think this is pretty much just range-based sort of deal. Yeah. I mean, 
mean, this is going well so far. Now I'll be saving money for some more insane upgrades. Yeah, this is going good. I think the whole idea behind this quest or behind this map is to just have all the range towers set up here and just clear out everyone. Ooh, heavy infantry. Yeah, so the catapult should do a lot of damage. They are slow, but still, this is going to be tough. This is going to be very tough. Yeah, he does quite a lot of damage, but I don't think that's going to be enough. Um, what do we do? What do we do? What do we do? Did I at least did I kill at least one of them? Okay, one of them is dead. Uh, bu -bu 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 -bu. Mace Tower. Come on, come on. No, give me my Mace Tower upgrade. I was late. Oh no. Oh no, I should have built him here. Oh gee. Do I even have a chance? I actually do have a chance of defending against these guys. Because they're quite low now. It's only question if the towers are gonna do enough damage till the end. I'm not spending money. If I succeed, I succeed. If I don't, I don't. Another one dead. This one is also dead, almost. Can you focus on the other one? Yes. Dude. Oh no. They're not even... Oh, come on. Why didn't you shoot at him? Shoot at him! Yes! One more shot! No! No! Kill him, please, please, please! Who? So only one went away. Okay. What's the next wave? Again, these guys. Light armor. Mm, right. I need some more money in order to upgrade my towers properly. Come on. Come on. Kill him. There we go, the ghost. Oh, the ghost is gonna go down, I hope. Maybe. Yeah, one ghost is down. The other one, I think he's gonna pass. But we are going to upgrade yes. this dude. Oh, I didn't upgrade him even... Oh, no. Uh, they must have tasted the beer. Nobody can stop their thirst for beer. We have to retreat again and build a defense ring around the tavern. Okay. These are the heavy dudes. Ooh, 500 health. I guess that's the boss. Yeah, there's only one of them or one of him. Well, let's see how this goes. Are we going to kill him? The problem is... Uh, I should have upgraded another tower. I didn't want to do this. Not like this. Oh well. It's gonna go as it's gonna go. Not much else to do, I guess. Kill him. Bless. 
I would like to see maybe more variety of upgrades. So I like what they did with archers where you can choose two paths. But I would like to see the same variety when it comes to mages where you could maybe be able to, let's say, make the mages use some kind of um, ice spells to slow the enemies down but don't do a lot of damage or then maybe a fire towers or or molten towers that would maybe do something like i don't know like aoe damage or you know you know you need some more variety when it comes to the tower upgrades to to be to just to make it more strategic you know Maybe I would place like a frost tower here instead of a normal mage tower so that he would, I don't know, slow the enemies down when they are passing here as well and then... Is that it with this wave? Victory! Perfect! Well guys, you know what? This is gonna be it for this episode. If you do like the video, if you like the gameplay, please like, comment, subscribe and tell me in comments if you want to see another episode of this game. But until then, I have to go play some other games, okay? Okay, I'll see you in the next episode, guys.